Oh shit. Okay, welcome back to normal mode, guys. Yo. One sec, I'm gonna check the options real quick of like the escape menu. Cause I don't hear the music and I don't know if that's like a normal thing. No, music's correct, Mundo. Okay. Resume. Maybe there's just no music at that part. Yeah, it's. Yep, here we are. We got the music back. We can turn it up a little bit. Enjoy it on our side. Mm hmm. So, uh. Quick heads up, uh, normal motors who are curious, um, Banga is currently in a different city, kind of looking for job opportunities there, so he's gonna be on an extended hiatus, he doesn't really know when he'll be back. So, um, Al and I are just gonna take the helm of this thing. Yeah. Uh, since Dan doesn't know Final Fantasy X, and would have no fucking clue what's going on, cause we're already like 65-70% of the way through, right. we're not gonna pull him in, and we- <clears throat> us two are just gonna have a fucking nostalgia trip through this shit. We're fucking doing like, and we're just fucking like at the best temple. I, f I hate this place. Right. I cannot stand it. Right. Does this do anything? I don't think it does. I still don't get why you can only take one. He has two hands. Right. <laughs> hey, we have two holes, so we can shove them in one of those and then our anus. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, like that's another thing. He had he technically has like multiple orifices, right? Like I don't understand why we can't just not, shove one into his butthole. Not to mention like, um, but no, like not to mention also like there are multiple members of the party and they don't hold any spheres at all. Like imagine how much easier this would be if every like party member could hold at least one sphere. I've always assumed they were in hammer space for all of these because they're built for one person at a right. time. <gasps> it did a thing. I don't think it actually does anything in that format. I think Maybe. I have to like run power through it or some shit. I don't know. But uh, yeah, this dungeon is the ragiest dungeon, I think. Mm -hmm. Out of all of them, it's the <clears throat> most irritating. Uh, just because it is a lot of backtracking and timing. Yep. And some of the timing is really shitty. Oh, hey, we can go down. Nice or it job. has the illusion of being shitty. Right. Like, you can actually go, like, a variety of different ways. Oh my god, so fucking slow. Whoa, it stops? I don't remember that. Wah, wah, wah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking weird ass motherfucker. Uh, don't you talk shit on me. I'll talk as much shit on you as I want. <laughs> Did you just say you'll shit on me, Al? Yes. <laughs> oh, and you'll man. enjoy it because that's the kind of person you are. Yeah, I will. I'll enjoy being shat. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> You're like, okay, I was being facetious. Don't you mean fecalis? No. <laughs> it's going a little bit too far. You're so fucking stupid. Oh. What the fuck? This fucking angle. I did not ask for this. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, we'll go. We'll go this way. <laughs> ah, it was going so fast. I know, right? Ivy, stop slapping the wall. <laughs> what were you hitting? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> What? <laughs> <laughs> Look, we were talking about, like, feces, so of course I have to act like I'm constipated this episode. <laughs> oh, right, I forgot this bullshit. Right. God damn it. Oh, yeah. I forget, is this the way to get the uh, secret treasure or the way out? Out. Uh, you right. always get the secret treasure in this dungeon because you can't come back here after it's completed. Well, like, if I remember right... You can actually screw yourself out of this one. Can you? Yes. I don't think so. Uh, you have to take it for the cutscene to start. Do you? Uh, yeah, because after after you leave this dungeon, it is barred off from from for the rest of the game, and uh, you can't get Anima without it. So they the developers intentionally made oh, it to yeah, where you couldn't right. skip it. That's right. Everybody who's like new to the tin lore is like, what the fuck is Anima? Mm-hmm. For anyone who's played fucking uh, Final Fantasy XIV, they're like, oh no, Anima. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Anima kind of like, eh. Let's see. Uh, I don't, I don't know how to oh. feel. Oh yeah. Mm. 
Is that right? Yeah. <laughs> Fucking dumbass. Oh, yes. Ha! Get wrecked. Fucking time and base bullshit. <laughs> I did not know Lionels could teleport. Yep. <laughs> Which is kind of weird because like they actually have like arrows for like ranged attacks. Shit! I took the glyph sphere to her. Really? <laughs> yeah. What are you supposed to do with it? Put it over there, I think. Oh, and you're supposed to use a. Uh, uh, yep. Like, Son of a, a bitch. Spear, Oh no! I'm cool with it. Oh no! Cool. Ivy is shoveling down apples one after another as yep. she plays Breath of the Wild, like over in the other area. <laughs> okay, the timing thing was offset that time. I don't know if I could potentially get over there, you know? Right. Okay, for the love of God, work. <laughs> Two. Two. God damn it! There was just no way. Really? I don't think I, don't think I could have gotten that one. Let's try this shit again. There yeah! we go. I made it work that time, motherfuckers. So you gonna leave the uh, glyph sphere here? Yeah. But like, uh, yeah, um, this part of the game is where we start to get to like the very, I guess the end part of it, I gotcha. think, in my opinion. Like, uh, so like, one thing I think is actually kind of weird is like, uh, early, early on in the game, they say that the, uh, Cloister of Trials can be pretty, uh, dangerous, like, it's... But really, like, the only ones that actually... There's only one that actually has fiends, and it's in a uh, place where mo... And it's in Xanarkin, so, like, most people wouldn't know about that it. That one has fiends? I think so. And then you just walk across this yeah. shit. Spear-shaped recess. All right, and let's I get to it. I thought I was done with recess when I got, when I got out of elementary school. That's another one of those words in this language that has multiple meanings, but it's spelled the exact same. What? Elementary? No. Recess. God, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like tear and tear. Oh, yeah. God damn oh, it. Oh, man. Fucking time like, and base bullshit. Right. Oh, I just watched Ivy get fucking destroyed by a Lionel. It was brutal. Mm-hmm. Could not be shown on television. Yep. Yeah. And she's like, you yeah. fuckers are talking shit on me. <laughs> I'm gonna beat the fuck out of you. <laughs> oh, man. But, like, um... I personally think these are the most boring <coughs> parts of the game. Right. Just because I would prefer fiends in them, honestly. Yeah. I mean, it doesn't make any sense for the fiends to be there because right. there aren't many dead people in here, but... But yeah, it's like... I also have another question. What's up? Do we send oh. people uh, after we kill fiends? I think that's what killing a fiend does. Like, it sends the uh, souls... I would think so. Because, like, when you uh, when you kill them, you see the uh, The fireflies. souls drift off, yeah. yeah. But I wonder if it does kill them or if Yuna sends them, like... Maybe. You know. I could see that. Also, I fucking love, like... I fucking love how much Bango was, like... Uh, just questioning the fact that Seymour was back. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, he didn't, he didn't stop to think that, uh... That, uh, you know, the dead can still exist after they're dead. Yep. But if they're corrupted by envy uh, and greed and shit, that's when shit gets bad. Mm-hmm. It was pretty funny. Mm. 
What happens okay. if you put a uh, Bavel uh, That opens Bavel the sphere. final, I think. I think that opens the final room. Gotcha. What's the uh, destruction sphere there for, then? It's for the very end of the game. Gotcha. Or the end of the thing. Nope. I need this to open the path to the fucking end. I think it may right. be on the top floor. Or maybe it was the fucking one that used to have the, uh, the glyph. I can't remember. Yeah, it, it is, I believe. So basically what you're saying, B, is that as long as you have that sphere, then the door is open. No Kingdom Hearts references. But it's square, and no. this is square. <laughs> Speaking <laughs> of, uh, that's another thing. Dan, who is in the room with us, also playing Breath of the Wild. <laughs> we have two different switches in the room right now, and both of them have Breath of the Wild being played on them, I think. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Dan's generally playing Breath of the Wild or fucking Mario Kart, where he's beating my ass with red shells consistently. <laughs> uh, I, is there a way in Mario Kart 8 to remove the two item thing? Wait, what? I believe there's a way in Mario Kart to remove the two item thing. Two item thing. Oh. Maybe? I'm not entirely sure. You can take off items. Cool. Oh. In that case, we should fucking do that with the uh, red shells and the uh, No, uh, no, 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 no. The keep, keep the red shells. Just make it one item per person so they can't store items because that's how the original was and the original was much more balanced right because it was balanced with that in mind and fucking take out the fucking shocky thing uh the shock's okay so long as you only have one item because if you're storing two items of great value then the shock is doubly powerful but consider that with 12 characters and mm -hmm. it's very overpowered yeah Does this do anything? I can't fucking remember. Didn't you get one of these from here? Yeah, I think so. No, it doesn't do anything. But like, uh, yeah. Um... I don't remember what we were talking about. We got <laughs> off on a huge fucking- uh, Oh yeah, Dan. We are gonna get a capture card here soon, so oh, we nice. can do fucking fun shit. Like, yeah. all of the like, fucking PS4 games. Like, we could do Persona. We could Fuck do yes! we, we could do GTA San Andreas. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, it's just because, like, I know you personally don't care much for the uh, Grand Theft Auto games. Oh, yeah, I really <laughs> don't. I played Grand Theft Auto online once, and me and my friend went to the top of some kind of mountain <laughs> where there was a, uh, there was, like, this satellite thingy. And, uh, we punched each other off of it. Like, it was mm -hmm. a game to see which one would get their asses handed to them. I think this may be. Oh, shit, it already has one in it. I gotta fucking remember which which one I go to to, uh, to go down to, like, the very bottom level, you know? Right. That's what I'm fucking, like, trying to figure out right now. Okay. Like I said, this fucking cloister sucks. It's pretty rough. Mm-hmm. But uh yeah, we wanna we wanna do a capture card shit so we could play like Nintendo games and then have Nintendo slam our asses with copyright strikes. <laughs> <laughs> they already did it for our uh Majora's Mask theory crafting. Right. We're actually we've got another theory crafting in the works for uh fucking uh Breath of the Wild. I can't say much about it because we're still like ironing out all the details. I don't remember which way I'm going here. Um, that way. Okay, but yeah, we're gonna do that, and then we'll probably pick up. I think you wanna take this first path to the right. Oh, it's so close. Yeah, I got it. Um, unfortunately, oh, yeah. unfortunately, Breath of the Wild doesn't really add anything interesting to the timeline. <laughs> right. Because that's kind of like one of our main curiosities when we do uh, Zelda uh, theory crafting, is like timeline shenanigans, shenanigans, because, uh,. It was Twilight Princess that introduced them, and uh, they kind of hobbled together a series of timelines as best they could. Mm -hmm. And you know, people have mixed mixed beliefs on uh, how good they are, but like, you know, it's still interesting to study into. Right. I think this is about the last of it, Al. Maybe. Oh, yep. There's that treasure chest. Don't you maybe meet? <laughs> 
Oh yeah, there's the uh, there's the uh, optional treasure chest I was talking about, but there's the mandatory one. Yep. How do you get to that one though? This. Oh, okay. Ah! Ah! Damn it! See ya. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> God it's, damn. It's so slippery. Why did you put oil on it before you smoked it? Wait, wait, wait. I think I realize why. I don't think you can. God damn it. <laughs> I don't think you can push it without this thing being in it. Maybe. But then you can't do. Oh. You, you gotta go back. No, I, I, I can go back. You can? You can. Dude, I don't fucking know. I, can, I don't even fucking know if I can push this piece of shit. I guess not. Push, pretty please. And... <laughs> yeah, I may have fucked myself over. Right, but that's not gonna stop you from a... Uh... I think it's just a lance for Kamari anyway. Maybe. Kamari honestly doesn't have a whole lot of good weapons. That's because Kamari isn't a very good character right. like, for combat or anything. Then what are we standing here for? Oh, I'm so angry! Uh, oh shit, I just realized I'm a scrawny ass 17 year old. Hey. <laughs> uh, you can stuff your taboos! <laughs> I wish they would cuss a little bit like Persona to make the audio less like... Uh... What's the word for it? Like cringy, I guess. Right. A but then more believable. Yeah, a little more believable. Right. A little, a little more natural. If you but guys like, don't mind, I am going to eat sour punch straws. This <laughs> episode is not sponsored by sour punch straws, by the way. Sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Oh, hey. Is even the guys who make these things? Like, oh, I have no idea. A faith. I think it's funny that Titus like with the doesn't even recognize what it is, despite the fact that he knows of only one thing that is in this place. Right. in stone by ancient Yevon rites. Also, I completely forgot that fucking rest. Banga was one episode away from, from finding out who that fucking kid was. Right. <laughs> yep. Ah, oh, I am weak. <laughs> Bleh. Yeah. Cracks her head on the glass. Mm. <laughs> Wait, so she has a kid inside her now? Yep. Wording. <laughs> yep. Oh, man. They were doing the uh, bland facial recognition like 12 Wait, years before Mass Effect did it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Wait, don't come outside! I mean, there's only one door. I just right. want to talk about this with you guys. There's the last of them. Oh. You are to stand trial. <laughs> I expect it will be a fair trial. Aaron with the snappy comebacks. Mm -hmm. Of course it will. That dude's face is so fucking fat. Wow, yeah. Dan. I'm just You're saying. You're right. Like, <laughs> Bahamut. They literally okay, what just are we gonna name him? Circle for his face. Huh. Ah, oh, shit. Oh no. Jamaica. Jamaica. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Um, we'll do a new save data just in case Banga wants to like play through again. Right. The High Court of Yevon is now in session. Away. <laughs> <laughs> the sacred officers of this court seek nothing but absolute truth. In Yevon's name. Okay, there's a flaw in that. To those on trial, believe in Yevon and what, speak only the Yevon? truth. Mm -mm. <laughs> Maester Kelk Ronso. 
Thanks for the exposition, Lulu. Summoner Yuna. I didn't know he was a Ronto until now. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I thought he was just a really hairy dude with like a skin condition <laughs> and a horn. <laughs> mm -hmm. then <consider laughs> and he's half unicorn. <laughs> you have inflicted dire injury upon Maester Seymour. He doesn't look hurt to me. <laughs> right. <laughs> Not to mention, he has a pretty freaking great mustache. Oh yeah, I want to talk about the whole Albed insurrection thing. That uh, the order of that never actually happened. Nor did she conspire with them Tell to do anything. God they kidnapped her. Yeah. You to participate in such violence. But then again, people are gonna believe what the uh, the maesters say. So. The real traitor. Right. Is Maester Seymour? He killed his father Jisco with his own hands. Cool. What is this? I never really liked that dude anyway. Hmm? Haven't you heard? Not only that. Maester Seymour is already dead. I just it is a summoner's sacred duty to send the souls of the departed to the far plane. Yuna was only doing her job as a summoner. Uh oh. I just saw how that uh And Maester oh. Micah. Please send Seymour now. Send the unsent to where they belong? See, what I never understood here is why is every fucking yes. maester able to send others? <laughs> are they also summoners? I'd imagine they are. Like, maester? they're the leaders of the, uh, of the religion. The day. Mm -hmm. And the religion is centered around summoners. You would have to send so, me. So, I want to point out that uh, there's what? an irony in here. That is there Grand nobody Mister in the world Micah who has realized so that Micah has lived past his age? To how long, like, uh, like everyone and knows like he's really old, but how long actually has he lived? The That's the thing, the like, living. Uh, the unsent are considered, uh, well, atrocities, right. you know? So, like, why would he, why would nobody contest that at all? I mean, they probably just assumed that he was, that he was lucky to live a really long time. Yeah, still, like, nobody is like, I have a theory that Mike is dead. At the same time, V, this is a world just filled with, like, uneducated masses. That's true. Like, there is what one is message uh, that, that is in, like, many Final Fantasy games. I'm it's that religion me. is, like, the antithesis like of education. Me. Right. And that's a a really, like, I am pretty that sure that, <laughs> that Square just fucking you, despises organized religion or something, because they are always against it. Probably. And it's not even about like the whole killing a god sort of thing. Uh huh. It's it's against corruption of re of organized religion. Right. Their battles, their sacrifices. Were god, they this camera all in work. Vain? Mm hmm. <laughs> not in vain. No matter how many summoners give their lives, sin cannot be truly defeated. Their rebirth cannot be stopped. Yet the courage of those who fight gives the I like this way motif. Oh yeah, of, uh, there is the nothing yeah. futile no, in uh, the life and death of a summoner. I actually just realized when he was talking about sin like coming back, never he referred futile, to sin he referred to it as that ending. as there. there. Yeah, because he understands like, that yeah. Yeah. Well we won't spoil it. Indeed, right. that is the essence. So of I want to point out that thus far they have still not talked about her crimes. <laughs> nope. Yep. I mean, they... Well, they talked about them and then asked them to put in their piece, right? And they're like, the summoner was just doing her job. And then uh, they're, they never actually rebuke that or refute that whatsoever. They just say this. Like, yeah, these teachings that are not actual teachings that they have never actually explained to the masses, mm -hmm. apparently you're traitors for not knowing them. Mm -hmm. So, isn't the entirety of Spirit traitors? It's just... Get me uh, out of here! Bad writing. Now. Okay. You hear me? No. You waste your breath. <laughs> I love how there's like writing on the floor. Oh, there is. Mm -hmm. What do you think that says? Uh, I don't know. I mean, we could probably take the time to uh, 
I hope Yuna's okay. Uh, I mean, you know. it just says, mm. Tidus is a big loser. Uh -huh. <laughs> She's strong. You're crying. So you always cry. <laughs> <laughs> like, this is the self Jack Jack probably in. found Why? himself so here at one right. point. I mean, uh, he was met in the prisons of Bavel. Uh, yep. Why is it that would actually be pretty great if this was everything the exact in cell he was in. Seems mm -hmm. to revolve around people dying. Uh, the spiral of death. Huh? Summoners challenge the bringer of death, sin, and die doing so. That's nifty. Guardians give their lives to protect their summoner. Oh yeah, I'm gonna mess with the microphone. The faith are the souls of the dead. Even the there ministers of Yevon are unsent. Not all of them. Spira is no, that monster guy's pretty chill. Just two of them. Out only of four. Oh yeah. Born, and then only to bring more death. It is a cycle of death, spiraling endlessly. Cool. More exposition <sighs> that we already knew. Mm-hmm. Oh man. Oh shit. We should probably stop the fucking episode oh, here. Yeah. Okay, our decided. sentence has been decided. We'll find out what it is. Sentence. Next up, Orin. Don't you mean execution? Catch you guys later. See ya.